Welcome to the Chip and Cern Show, the podcast about everything and nothing at the same time. They were possibly separated at birth, only to be rejoined to create the sweet sounds that will caress your deepest cochlea. The show is real, random, rant-filled, and ruthless. Please be warned that this show may hurt your feelings, offend your grandma, and even kick your dead dog in the balls. So get ready, and let's get this shit started. This shit has started. I am Chip. I'm Cern. And you are listening to the Chip and Cern Show once again. Yes, thank you for tuning in and spreading the word. It's always nice to uh, share it around with everyone. So if you like, like, uh, like herpes, <laughs> that's not a nice thing to share around. No, unless you're at a tart party or something. <laughs> uh, Gross. <laughs> speaking of, well, uh. We've been around for almost two years now, the Chip and Cern Show Part Two, uh-huh. Part Two, yes, and our highest ranked episode, and by by in terms of downloads, is about poop. I can see, I can see that, and it's so we thought, well, why not go to the well again? And we are the crutch. We've been secondary crutch. Secondary crutch. Joe. Joe's our primary. Primary, and then feces is number two. <laughs> And in the same family, it is also in Joe smells. <laughs> it's also in the news. Oh. Colorado's having a little poop problem. Poop problem. Um, they call her the mad pooper. Her. Her. Hmm. Okay. Colorado Springs police seeking runner who won't stop pooping in front of a family's home. So this lady that they well they now know it's a lady because they set up some cameras and, and uh-huh. caught her and, and also uh the, the children uh spotted a beaver out on the lawn. <laughs> beaver and a crack, yep. <laughs> um and she was out there running and I guess she dropped her pants around her ankles. Which oh, this rookie move. You're gonna fucking pull your pants all the way down if you're right. Might as well fucking kick your shoes off, too, <laughs> while you're at it. Jesus. <laughs> Haven't you ever taken a shit in the woods? Yeah, I know. So I guess the kids came in and told, and there's a lady taking a poop. Oh, my God. Well, first off, I don't know if I would believe that. Someone said, there's a lady pooping on your lawn. I'm like, mm. Do you think the kids were telling tall tales? Yeah. Hmm. Lies. Lies. But I guess... Uh, so the mom went out, uh, confronted the woman. Are you really taking a poop right here in front of my kids? Her response was, yep. Sorry. Now, I consider myself a runner. And I will say that running and pooping in unfortunate areas kind of go hand in hand a little bit. Yeah. It's sort of an, ex- I don't want to say an accepted practice, but. Fires up the engine. It ha- Yeah. You start running and shit jostling around. You know, your intestines get loose, loose shit loosens up in there. Just jars it out. You know, it, it's going to happen to you if you if you run for any amount of time. You're going to be in a, a shitty situation where it sneaks up on you and you got emergency on your hands. Um, so I'll give her I'll give her one. Saying it was an act like saying this is saying won't this is a multi- stop. won't stop. So. Two and three times pooping, um, worrisome. So the, the apparently remorseless runner has pooped on the sidewalk in front of this per- this family's home uh-huh. for at least once a week for the past seven weeks. So it's at least seven poops. Okay, and I'm I'm taking a week off work, and I'm gonna sit out there yeah. like. Uh, um, cat, uh, Caddyshack hunting the fucking gopher. <laughs> Grand Torino. Bill Bill Murray hunt, hunting the gopher. Yeah. Do you hide? Do you wear like camouflage and hide in the bushes? And then when this fucking person ghillie suit, yeah, fuck it, but <laughs> like you're in Call of Duty. Barrett fifty cal this bitch. I, I would I, I I would stake out and maybe possible trip wire. I don't know. Wow, the know. person has, um been caught three times whilst pooping 
the fucking. What do you? She posted flyers. Oh, that'll stop her. Yeah, bitch. that'll. You've confronted her. What did I say? Three times. And. So now you're gonna post flyers. So what do you yeah, do? I mean, stop her. is that assault or something? A decent exposure. Oh. Okay. Possibly seven you, times. Going, and there's I'm kids going, there too. I'm going hate crime. And there's kids oh. that could be. You ooh, could be on ooh, minor? Megan's oh, law yeah. for that shit. Well, how old do you think this lady is? So we okay, have, CERN's got the tweet up going? there. Mad pooper wanted by Springs police. She looks about... Yeah, this... 45? Yeah, 40, 45. 50, her running maybe? form could use work. She sh- should lean forward a little bit. It's, yeah, her and knees are pretty far out. She's kind of leaning back. She needs... And she's so she's not wiping... So this, uh, I think this is an attack. This is an attack. And then if, if she does have a spouse at home of some sort, it's an Ooh. attack on them too. Oh, not only is it, oh man, not the post run smells, but you're like not, no, there's no wiping going on. So Charmin oh. tries to get the mad pooper to turn herself in with a brilliant ploy. Oh, um, the ploy was let me just um uh, Charmin's the toilet paper team that um used the uh those bears in their yeah, commercials, where right? They, like go on vacation, yeah. pack some suitcases and toilet paper. Yeah, I yeah. Hate it. I hate it. But um if this is Charmin tweeted. Okay. If the mad pooper turns herself in, oh. we'll give her a year supply of TP to help with her runs. Mm. Oh, I like it. Now she's wearing very tight fitting lycra shorts as well. I got to think that's a problem with the the lack of wiping as well. Yeah. That's going to get all. That's not. I mean, obviously, it's not sanitary, but, you know, she's probably got some other issues down there with the the naughty bits. Yeast infection, gangrene, something like that. I don't know. I just know back to front. No, front to back. I don't know. That's what I've been told. Um, so what do you, when they capture this lady, what do you think what do you think Fancy she's going <laughs> to what do you think she's going to say? I don't know. Why were you pooping in this house? So my my hope is that these people have a dog and she's just retaliating with poop on her front lawn. Oh, that would be really poop. good with her poop. That's what I'm I'm hoping. Otherwise, if this is just, I mean, if this is just a, a serial pooping, a random pooping, it happen to anybody. It happen to you, Chip. Actually, we did have a revenge pooper in our in our old apartment in San Francisco. Revenge pooper. A revenge pooper. I remember coming down, and the landlord, the you know, eighty year old uh, uh, Chinese guy, was saying, um, "It's a homeless person that." It, he turned in or he called because he was sleeping in the area uh, and he came back and he bestowed his revenge on our apartment complex <laughs> by defecating on oh, okay. on it. Okay, that's one way to do it. Okay. Yeah, I'm like, okay, he's got us, I guess. I mean, I don't know. What do you do about that? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what you would do about that. That's <laughs> So if you saw, okay, if you walk out in the morning, you're about to leave for work and someone's running up or you walk out and she's popping a squat on your lawn what do you do she's getting the can you, hose you, can you or tackle some, some, i don't know if you want to tackle oh that would be a messy oh, yeah that could be real if messy. you miss the tackle oh, and slip or something rip. just right oh that would even be worse if you slip and like like in a movie you and someone else's the business, shit underneath the oh. business end of what's going on oh man just <laughs> shitting on you oh <laughs> near Ooh. um sprayer the hose throw something at her like wait right there. Oh, go to my fridge. I'm gonna get a couple of eggs to throw at you. Just wait right there. <laughs> Cause I'm trying. Yeah, I'm trying to think. What is is it technically your private property? And she's trespassing, sort of. Um. Yeah. I would because say that. You know, as a as a runner, if I pooped on someone's thing, I would be so mortified to ever run by their house again. Let uh, alone. Oh yeah. You know, unless she's next door and it's like her. <laughs> route that she's forced. <laughs> That'd be brazen. <laughs> Sally? <laughs> what are you doing? 
<laughs> just, just shitting you on gotta the You gotta go. You gotta go. That's true. Now, as a guy, it's one of a great uh, privilege as a penis owner to urinate wherever, uh, you know, convenient, I guess. Not wherever, but within reason on your property. Yes. Um, moving out of the city, it's been great some nights after one too many, uh, you know, uh, IPAs to just let it let it go, go off yeah. the edge of the deck. When, when, you, when you're uh, <laughs> one too many IPAs in, mm-hmm. somehow going walking down the, the toilet and peeing in the toilet at the bridge too far. It like, doesn't make much sense. I'm going to walk farther to the outside. I'm going to piss off the yeah. ground. I'm going to piss outside. And the way I sort of justify it to myself sometimes too is, there's a lot. There's a lot of like wildlife and shit around. Just want to show everyone who's bought, who's the big swing and dick around to these parts. Marking my territory, right? And also, Suck my dick. <laughs> also, I had asparagus, and I'd like that the neighborhood to know ah, about the okay, asparagus. Okay. Sharing the dinner, okay. yeah. Um, I I don't know about the poop. The poop thing. I when I was running the San Francisco Marathon a couple of years ago came up and the marathon's 26 something miles i came up around mile 11 and i was smelling a, a s- strong odor i thought well you know may someone might have a gasser cut a gasser yeah and i look crop, crop dusted okay yeah which is kind of rude because it's a wide you know they block off uh, like okay. two or three yeah. lanes so there's plenty of you know it's like if you're going to spit a loogie, you just kind of look over your shoulder and you you shall fire it out. You don't just fucking willy-nilly that shit, right? <laughs> and I look up. Check the flight path behind you. There you go. And there's, you know, runners wear typically the shorter, kind of yeah, yeah. very lightweight shorts. There is diarrhea juices uh, on both legs coming down his unshaven, uh, hairy. Uh, so he has diarrhea juice in his. Man, that's gross. And I'm like, oh my god, that dude! And you look, there's the clearly fancy boy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the fancy boy. I can't handle poop. And clearly, there's like, there's a load in uh, the no. the thing. And I'm like, I looked at my watch, like, damn, we're at mile eleven. This fool's got d- this, and then another, He's got a another while. some he after. Got, he's got a while. I think. If that happened to me, I probably am. I'm probably gonna tap out. Uh, yeah, I'm probably just gonna quit. <laughs> <coughs> he was determined. I don't think I would only allow myself to let the bowels completely drain if it was, hey, you can win, and it's right there. It's a hundred yards away or something, and it's a sprint, yeah. and it's like everything I have, and you know, you maybe like take a chance, but. Mile ten. I mean, there's no. porta potties all yeah. over. Like yeah. this guy, I, I don't know. Take a sec, pal. Yeah, he must have carb loaded or something. It did him dirty. Yes. Well, I think we're. Oh man. Three sixty. Three sixty. Cam Chip just yawn. got a fucking a mega yawn. Mega. Like a cat. When a cat wakes oh. up from a nap. Oh, there you big, go. Oh. Oh yeah, the big the, with them fangs and the yeah. and stuff. Ooh. Yeah. Oh You're yeah. more of a dog person though, right, Cern? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> well, dogs poop. Bougie bitch. <laughs> <laughs> when dogs poop, it's common practice to pick it up with the bag. Uh, out and out and about. Yeah. Oh, so maybe she should have some bags on her. Okay. Would would it be more acceptable if she just picked it up? That would be, yeah, it would. Yeah, but it's still fucking odd that even like, hey, I'm going out for a run. I really, like, what if she has like Crohn's disease or some shit, irritable bowel syndrome, mm. IBS. Um, but they have to find her. And Chip and Cern interrogate this. I mean, we one we keep fucking making a murder dude, Stephen Avery in the in the slammer. Um. <laughs> The pooper, we could never let her go. She's get more guilty than Avery, and she, she would. But the the thing that bo- bugs me the most, or is is the most curious to me, is why the same house with less evidence than Avery. yeah. And <laughs> there's a fucking picture of her. Like, if this is the local thing, 
people have seen her because, you know, runner or if you're exercising, I guarantee this is her outfit. Oh, you yeah. know, or four similar. four mornings a week. Yeah, or something very very yeah. similar. Yeah. Oh yeah, she bought these shorts because she likes how the, you know she, they think her ass doesn't look that horrible, even though it looks like a a fucking shitty Denny's pancake. <laughs> um, and oh, yeah. so sh- she has to have been identified already. So fuckable. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I there's no question she she's been identified. She has to be ID'd. I don't know. I don't know how how many people are in. Um, I'll do a little recon here. So Chip's doing some recon. Um, Colorado Springs. Yes. Let's see how many people are there. Population. The, we'll back into some here. Well, we'll. The population's grown steadily since 1990. Uh, it's about half a million. Folks. Mm, that's a lot of folks. So, and Denver is 682 thousand. Okay, so, you know. She has some odds on her yeah, side. Yeah, it's looking good for her. Okay, okay, I can go I can go for that. What are Colorado Springs famous for? No, the mad pooper. Um, <laughs> that would be number hilarious. one. Number one, mad pooper. Number two? I don't know. I don't know either. That's it. Oh, they have new photos of the mad pooper 15 hours ago. This is breaking news. Wow, they have more. So she's wearing the same outfit again. Oh. So like I like I said, um, there. Yeah, Charmin offered a year thing. She's been using the toys for Suck a month. My dick. <laughs> Young <laughs> kids actually <laughs> witnessed this. Oh, oh. International media attention. Oh, this is it right here, right? Yeah, that's the picture that I see right there from the DenverChannel.com. So there's three different images from three uh, different aspect ratios. I would I would think. I mean, you can, Summerfield, like, they have this person's address. So even do, be crazy. Draw a 10-mile radius around it. Yeah, you can back into it. Yeah, you can find this this person pretty easy. I would think like I could probably pick those shoes out and you can go to the local running store and say, you know, give us all the size, uh, women's size seven to 10, uh, yeah. A six and blue you that you them. sold. Um, why do we need why to did, fucking do the she detective a, work ourselves? She should have like a butt flap on her, on her thing. Like one of those oldie time pajamas. Yeah. If she's, if she's doing some heinous crime like this, butt flap. Now, Let's let's examine her her wardrobe a little bit. Is this a one piece number? Uh, I think no. What so these are like spandex like pants. Yeah, those are like those spandex are. looking shorts. Yes. Sort of like cycling, like yeah. a bike shorts. Th- that's what I'm taking from it. Okay. So that means there's even <laughs> there's even more, um, more of a mess going on. Oh. No, these yeah. are just uh, stock stock uh, running footage. Summerfield. Oh, another photo. Man, these. This lady. She's got. No, that's somebody different. Oh my god. No, I. Okay, so if this happened to me, I'm getting a fucking Nest Cam. Oh. Yeah. And I'm planting it right on the yard, dialing that. I'm gonna get fucking plotting four K video footage from there. Plotting. Enhance, <laughs> enhance, enhance. Plot in their time. Yeah. Uh, I guarantee it's during a certain time that she runs. And then why don't they chase after her? I, I would. I don't know. I mean, if it's getting this kind of thing, you there's a non-emergency number, right? So the, do you think that she'll continue right now? Because there has to be news, people staking out. And oh, that's a good thought. To nab the mad pooper. I'm going to guess she's still going to do it. Because obviously there's some mental issue going on. So maybe maybe she maybe she switches her routine up to nighttime running. Oh. Under the cover of darkness. I don't know. But or does she seem do you think she gets off on it in any way? I don't th- I don't know. I think there mm. might be something with that. I'm telling you, I would increase my runs every week just to run into the mad pooper because you know what shoes she wears. 
Oh, you know, yeah. I mean, she probably, let's just say she has two or three pairs of shoes. I Now I see these, you know, sky blue with neon lace Asics or whatever. Yeah. I'm going to follow this lady until <laughs> I catch her in the act and then spear her. That, that would be a risky spear, but... What would you... It would have to be a side spear, probably. <laughs> yeah, have to be, yeah, you don't want to land on it. Side spear, and you have to have perfect technique, wrap up mid shoulder between the head and the and yeah the <laughs> or would what if you came from her and gave her a, like a stunner oh a stunner would work because anyway. if you stunned her into <laughs> her own shit that would be pretty fucking great no mop it up bitch or you could ride your bike because you were you would be a little bit more agile oh yeah and quick and then if you rode up and you saw her poop and then you could chase her Follow her or just follow her. Citizen's arrest, obviously. Just follow her at a distance. Okay. Find out where she lives. It's game. Everyone it's game. defecation yeah. on her yard. Her whole yard just be a big, big pile of shit. Yeah. There's, there, look at this, there's a giant log. <laughs> there's got to be, I can't wait to hear the story. This is going to be great. For the reasoning why. Yeah. Why, why did it happen? Yeah, I agree. Again, I'll give you one. I'll give you two in Let's different locations, but the same one, say, seven. seven time, at least seven times. <clears throat> but go to that note. I mean, this one? yeah. One, your Microsoft fucking word skills are dog shit. Yeah. To the female jogger. In bold and underlined. Continuously uses our wall as her toilet. Please stop immediately. You oh, okay. Okay. You're talking to someone that is shitting repeatedly on your yard and you think a fucking note on your stucco wall is going to stop? And, I mean, clearly, and you've confronted her already, so the note, now the note is going to stop? Right. <clears throat> I'm sure it was just trying to... Uh, it's like public notice. <laughs> There's been... You have put on notice. Family fed up with park defecation. Oh, is it a park? Now, this is where we could get into a little fake news situation is that what if this is actually, you know, they say, oh, it's our front yard, but it's a cross. It's in a park that she runs in and, oh. you know, it's like across the street. It's, it's all of our yards. Yeah. <clears throat> so that I'll be pretty mad if that. Happens. Yeah. So I think she just needs to wake up a little early and take that dump earlier. Yeah. Speaking from experience. And then, you know. Train the body to get get it on a schedule. Change the schedule. Totally. Or have that, that coffee a little earlier. There you go. Get, get, the, get the movement going. Get the BM going. Um, if you have any info about the uh, Mad Pooper, we got it. We have a listener in Colorado. Oh. I don't know where If, if, if it's your lives. mom or your aunt oh, too, or something. Or is it you? Just let us know. We won't tell you on you. Well, actually, if it is you, email actually to the Mad Pooper. <laughs> email us. We'll give you a Chip and Stern Show hat to wear in your next poop. There you go. We would. Oh, that'd be great. That, actually, the media attention would be. <laughs> could you fucking imagine? <laughs> that would be so good. <laughs> I would. I would take it. I would love it. Oh yeah. Um. We'll endorse our, our first endorsement, Mad Pooper. Yeah. We only hire uh, defecating criminals. <laughs> um, if you want to wear your own Chip and Cern Show hat whilst pooping, you can still get one. com slash shop. That'll do it. And if you have any good poop stories, maybe we'll, we'll compile. Maybe we should get Joe or Dana on to tell their poop stories. Oh, I'm sure Joe's got poop daily. stories. Oh, yeah. Daily. <laughs> He's got emergency situations daily, I'm sure. <laughs> I'd hate to know his fucking oh, man. poor toilet. How long, how He's doing double time. Through. Yeah. I may have cracked the porcelain on a few times. Oh, Jesus. Uh, yeah, all those fucking buffalo wings. He's <laughs> throwing down the... the yeah, Washing it down with beer. Oh, oh yeah. Christ. Oh, boy. Okay, we can't... We almost made it a whole episode out bagging on Joe, but, you know... It happens. When a crutch is a crutch, <laughs> it's a crutch. Sometimes you need to use it to balance. That's true. Anyway... Until next time, I'm Chip. I'm Cern. Cheers.